going to be doing a lesson today dealing with the topic of developing your speed with your hands on the drums. And uh, this is really, really important because there's a lot of music out there that involves faster playing techniques. And if your hands can't actually perform it and you can't play it smoothly with endurance, there's a lot of music that you're going to be cutting yourself off from the opportunity to be able to play. So I'm excited to talk to you about this today and uh, let's get started. Talk about how to develop the speed of your hands on the drums. I'm going to show you a couple different exercises that if you practice these every day, I would recommend 10 minutes a day, every day, as opposed to two hours one Saturday. If you do that consistently, you're going to see your hand speed dramatically improve with uh, your drumming. Um, take a few months, then six months, then a year, and uh, you'll be surprised at how much ground you're able to cover. So let me show you kind of a basic exercise. You're going to play four quarter notes with your right hand, and then you're going to do a series of sixteenth notes with your right and left combined. So let me just demonstrate that. One, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four. One, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four. And those are actually quarter notes and eighth notes, uh, not sixteenth notes. But it's important to count those, one, two, three, four, then one and two and three and four and, and you're playing exactly twice as fast as you were with one hand when you combine the two hands together. Then you'll want to actually take that and start it with the left hand, which will look like this. One, two, three, four, one. As you practice that over and over, you'll eventually build up speed. So you'll want to take it at a certain tempo and then increase gradually as you're able to do it smoothly. I would highly recommend getting a metronome, setting it at about 60 to 70 beats a minute, playing along with your quarter note speed at that 60 to 70 register. Once you're comfortable, continue to bump it up in increments of 10. So as you speed it up, it'll start to sound like this. And the reason we're doing this exercise is it's going to not only build your hand speed, but it's going to keep you in time and develop good rhythmic feel as you're learning how to actually double your speed when you start into those eighth notes. Okay, so those are some basic principles on developing your speed with your hands for the drums. And I do just want to encourage you to really practice these things every day. Um, if you can't do a lot of time every day, even 15 minutes will go a long ways as long as you're consistent with it. So this is a long-term thing, but you'll really reap the rewards as you continue to practice. 